Hi, my name is Buddy, and welcome to the Kaiser M3 workout series. Today's workout is going to be called the Pure Ride. We do a lot of drills that are going to challenge you physically and also emotionally. <laughs> Let's get started. Let's get warmed up here. Now, as you start to warm up, take your hands on position number one. It's right back on the back side. Good. Let's keep your shoulders down, keep those elbows bent, keep a nice even pace with the legs. Now let's have you take your hands to position number two on the side, right here. Breathing steady, start to get a little bit warmer here on the legs. As you breathe, take some deep breaths. You're doing great. All right, let's have you take position number three, hands on the ends. Again, watch your shoulders relax, elbows are bent, and slide those hips back just a bit more. So our last hand position is position number four. Take it all the way to the end. And notice as you hold this position, again, keep those shoulders down and those elbows bent. Now, if this is too far for you to reach, bring your hands back just a little bit more to here. All right, good. Let's have you take position number two. As you're moving, take some deep breaths again, inhale, and then a slow exhale. Keep the legs moving, getting warmed up here. All right, let's look down at your computer. As you look down at your computer, you'll see the top line is your revolutions per minute, also known as RPMs. Can you keep the RPMs around 80 to 100? That's it, just hold it steady. Your next line down is your watts, and that's your power. And remember, your power is equal to how fast your legs are going and what gear you're on. We'll get to that in a second. Now that second line is also your watts and also your kilocalories. All right, so it's gonna go back and forth. Next line down is your heart rate. So you have the heart rate strap, it's gonna read that as well. To pull our heart rate, it's gonna work. Your next line down is your time. So that's the time that we've been riding. Again, stay steady on the legs and watch that the heels stay down. I don't want the heels to come up. As you look down at your computer one more time, on the bottom left is your gear. You've got one to 24 years. And the bottom right is your distance. Let's hold it here, steady. Now remember for today's ride, we're gonna be riding 30 minutes cardio on the bike. So as you're moving, keep breathing. And at any time, if you wanna take a break, please do. Also get water if you get thirsty. Stay safe. Now look down at your gears. You'll see a gear shift in the center. Can you take your gear maybe two or three more gears? That's it. So now we're pushing more power. Notice how that affects your wants. So your power is coming up a little more. Ah, feeling good today. I'm glad you're working out with me. You're doing a good job today. Already working out. Steady. Now again, let's go back to those feet for a moment. Look down at your legs. I want you to notice your right leg. Push your right leg a little harder. Good. Notice how your shoulders stay down and keep it moving. All right, hold it here for just a second longer, and let's have you switch legs on the left leg. Breathing steady. Notice your heart is coming for more, and also notice that we're starting to get a little more warm. A little warmer, yeah? <laughs> Switching again on the right leg. Again, keep those elbows bent. Into this one. Switch again on that left leg. All right. Right now, let's make a decision. Can you go two or three more gears up? Do it now, let's go. So on your gears, you're anywhere from say gear five to gear number 10. Anywhere in that range is good. Still in that warm up phase. We're gonna hold this for another minute. Breathing steady. Keep that chest open. And again, relax those hands. Take another inhale. And then exhale. Hold your power steady. Notice that your power is probably around half of your body weight. So if you weigh 100 pounds, you're pushing about 50 watts. Good. Transitioning here, setting for our first drill. Now what we're gonna do is call the speed burst. So I'm gonna give you just a few seconds to increase your speed. Just a little more, maybe 10 RPMs. Notice how your power comes up. Let's hold it here. Uh-oh, can I ask you one more question? Can you go one or two more gears a little bit higher? Let's do it. All right, let's set up our first drill. Here it comes. Get ready. I'm gonna ask you to do a little speed burst. 15 seconds only. Are you ready? Let's start to go. 
Increase those RPMs. Be careful now, don't go past 110 RPMs. Steady. Pick up that pace. Hold it. In three, two, and one. Go back to where we were. 45 seconds. So now notice how the heart rate's coming up a little more. Power is coming up as well. Ah, good form here. Let's change the hand position. Hand position number one, a little more upright in that body. All right, we're gonna go for a second set. Can you go one more gear heavier? Let's do it. All right, coming up to our second set. Into that speed burst. Oh yeah. Nice even pedal stroke. Make sure that both legs are even. All right, about 10 seconds before you do that next speed burst. Now this time, can you get a little higher on your power, on, your, on those watts? All right, here we go. Ready? And let's burst. Go. Watch the legs. Steady on the legs. Almost there. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Ah, nice. Let's come back to where we started here. Hold it. 45 seconds on this recovery. Breathe. Now remember, if any point if you want to sit up, please do. Also get some water. At any point if you need to take a break, do that as well. Otherwise, stay with me and we're going to keep moving. Coming to our third set. Decision time again. Can you do one more or two more gears up? Let's try it. Hands on the sides. Coming into 15 seconds for the third set. Into the speed burst. Now remember, we're trying to just increase your speed a little more. Increasing a little more power. Here it comes in five seconds. On your marks. Get set. And let's burst. Here we go. Start to pick up that pace a little bit more. Good. Keep those shoulders down. Let me feel that power in the legs. Quick in legs. Four seconds. Three, two, and one. That's where we're. Let's do another set. How about one more set? I know you can do it. Steady. Keep that pace. Notice where that power is. And notice the RPMs. So back to where we started. Again, 80 to 100 on the RPMs. A little recovery on the legs. Oh, yeah. Hang on. You're doing great. Keep it moving. 15 seconds to go. Get ready for that speed burst. Got five seconds to go. On your marks. Get set. And let's burst. Here we go. Pick up the pace. Our last and final set here. Power is coming up. You got it. Looking good. How about five more seconds? Four seconds. Three, two, and one. Back to where you were. Hand position one. Shut up. Take some breath. We're going to set up our next sequence in just a moment. Again, we're taking a little recovery here. About a minute. So if you need to take some water, please do. If you have a towel handy, use that as well. Other than that, let's keep moving. Let's hold it here a little longer. I'm going to do about 20 more seconds, okay? Into the next set. Now we're going to transition into a hill climb. So I'm going to ask you to put a little more resistance on the bike, slow the, the RPMs down, and give you more power. All right, get ready. Here it comes. Now we're going to go heavier, slow down just a bit, watch the tempo, gear up maybe four gears, three to four gears. All right, let's find the new tempo. Hands on the sides, position two. We're going to start a climb up. So notice how the power is holding steady. Now if you happen to slow down, you got to increase that resistance to get the power up. Good? Yes. Can you give me another gear up? Let's do it. I'm going to hold it here for another 20 seconds. Good. Looking good. Now really push those feet down strong. Keep that chest open. That's it. Hold it. Decision time again. Can you give me one or two more gears up? Ah, oh, yes. Let's switch this one up. I'm going to give you about 30 more seconds. Yeah? Ah. Oh. Breathe. Let's transition out of this. 
I'm gonna give you another gear up, but this time I'm gonna take your standing position, all right? So give me just 10 more seconds, then we transition up. Here it comes. Ready? Let's gear on up. Two, three more gears and take it to the ends. Let's have you stand on out of the saddle. Now we start this climb up. Again, maybe the power is holding steady, I hope, yeah? RPMs are slower, which means you've geared up. Hold it there. Hold that climb. Good. Now we're gonna hold it here for a total of two minutes. If at any point it gets difficult, have a seat. We're gonna do a two minute climb with a one minute recovery. That's it. Make sure you're not too far forward. Stay over those pedals, over your power section. Yes. Good, keep that chest up. Looking good, I'm gonna give you one more minute here. Here we go. Breathe. Feel that music in your body. Relax the hands. And one more thing, make sure the hands aren't onto the ends, yeah? I don't want you to slip forward. So put the hands here on three. Good. Steady. Climb it up. Quickly look down at your watch, your power. Hopefully your watch are right now at your body weight. Pushing. You get about 30 seconds. Good. Steady. I like it. Keep moving. Almost there. We're coming up to about 20 seconds to go. Then I'll give you a recovery for one minute. Now remember, when you recover, come back to where you were in that opening, yeah? Maybe half of your body weight. Good. Eight seconds to go. Six, five, four, three, two. Have a seat. Ah. So gear down, one minute. If you need to get some water, get some water. Water's good for you. Keep moving. Hands on the side. Now listen, if resistance is too hard, come down a little bit. Also, if you're out of breath, keep sitting up. Yeah, this is your workout. It's your day. Empower yourself with some strong cycling today. Yeah, we have about less than 30 seconds on this recovery. Take some deep breaths. Let that heart rate come down. You're doing great. Now we're doing another set here. Two minute climb, one minute recover. This time we'll start with a one minute stand with a one minute sit. Got it? Make sure you adjust that adju attention if you need to. All right, here we go. Make your move, ready? Gear up three to five gears. Hands on the ends, stand up. Start this first minute. Let's start climbing. Now when you're climbing, make it about those muscles, the legs. Keep it strong. And again, be efficient. So when you're cycling, I want you to keep it strong and keep it moving. Looking good. Decision time, yeah? Can you give me another gear up? Let's do it if you can. How about two? Yeah, how about one more? Do it. There you go. 30 seconds on this climb. You're doing really good. Stay steady with me. Soft hands. Keep that chest up. 20 seconds to go. Breathe. Feel those legs. Now here it is. We're gonna come to a seated climb, but I don't want you to change the resistance if you don't have to. Yeah? If you have to, we'll come to that in a second. But don't if you don't have to. Are you ready? Have your hips come back. Sit down, let's climb. Now right away, notice, we've got more resistance on the bike. Pushing back, shoulders down. Now as you push, feel those legs. You got it. Stay with me now, you're doing good. Ah, this feels good on the legs. Keep climbing. We're coming up to around 30 seconds, yeah? Hold it. Now remember, you're gonna have a recovery after this. So push hard right now. Heart rate's coming up, yeah? Good, breath. Keep moving. Good form, everybody. That's it. Good, coming up to around 15 seconds. Finish strong. Heart rate is definitely up. Are you sweating? I am, yeah? All right, less than 10 seconds to go. Mm-hmm. Here's four, three, two, 
and recover. Come back to where we were. Half of your body weight. For those of you a little bit stronger, push maybe three quarters of your body weight. We've got a one minute recovery here. Set up to our third set. Now in this third set, here's what's gonna happen. We're gonna do a 45 second climb up with a one minute, 15 second seated climb. Then a one minute recovery. So notice that we're going two minutes on the hill climb, one minute recovery. Yeah? Give me what you can. Coming up to 30 seconds more. Watch that form. Chest is open. Take some deep breaths. I hope you're ready for this one. Now this one, I'm gonna challenge you a little more. If you can push a little higher gear and more power on the stand, about 10 seconds to go. Here comes your change. Three to five gears up. For those of you stronger, can you go maybe six gears? Yeah? Let's take a chance here. Start to gear up. Make your move, hands on ends. 45 seconds. Here's that climb up. Feel those legs. Power, yes. Strength. So feel it. Remember, it's your leg muscles that are gonna get the heart rate up. So we get the leg muscles to work. Burn those calories, you got it. Keep going. Keep it strong. Doing really good. Breathe. Yeah, this is tough, I know. I'm with you, come on. Almost there. You get about 10 seconds to go here. Keep that climb, soften those hands again, yeah? You got about three seconds. Hips back, two, one, sit down, let's go. Oh boy. Now really feeling this climb in the legs. Notice how your body positions change a little. You're pushing more power, shoulders down, the hips are back. Now keep it strong, good. Oh yes, we've got less than a minute right here. Stay with me, I know you got this. I'm with you. stay with me now. Push. We're coming up to the last 20 seconds, yeah? Ah, yes, come on. Actually, last 40 seconds, last 40 seconds, not 20, 40. <laughs> Good, keep moving. Okay, 30 seconds to go. Lower that heel just a bit. Keep it strong in the climb. 20 seconds right here. Let's go. Let me see your power. Hang on, push. We're coming up to about 10 more seconds. I know you're gonna finish it, come on. Here it comes for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Give me a one minute recover back to where we were. Woo, we've got one more set, yeah? One more set. Now in this last one, we're gonna do 30 second stand with a 90 second sit. Get some water if you need it here. Breathe, woo, I know. Working out is tough, but you're tough, yeah? All right, here we go, about 30 seconds. Hands on the sides. Now you give me what you can, that's all we ask. Give me whatever you have, give it strong, all right? Coming up to about 20 seconds to go. Change the hand position for a second, hands on position one. Let's hold, breathe. Coming into 15 seconds. What are you gonna do? You know what you do? What gear you're gonna be in, yeah? All right, about 10 seconds to go. Make your move, remember what gear you were at on that hill climb. Start to make your move, gear up now. To where you were, make your move, stand up. Let's start the climb. Now remember, on this climb, it's only gonna be 30 seconds on the stand, and then 90 seconds on the sit. So we quickly have to take the gear up. Get the power up quickly, heart rate comes up as well. 15 seconds. Can you give me one to two more gears up? Do it. Yes. Yes, hang on. Breathe. Looking good. Stay on it. All right, have a seat. 90 seconds. Shoulders down. Is this harder? Yes. So we're pushing harder, pushing stronger. Notice now the legs are pushing. So we can't rely on our body weight so much now. It's all about the legs. Now every time you push, think, I'm getting stronger. I'm pushing power. Keep going, looking good. Coming up to one more minute. I like it. 
Yes. Hang on. You're looking good. Remember, you're burning some calories, getting your heart stronger. You can't stop now. Finish the set. Oh, yeah. Hang on. We're coming to you in about 40 seconds to go. Decision time. Can you go one more gear? It's our last set. Let's do it. Come on. Yes. Coming in about 30 seconds. Breathe. Steady. Good technique. Breathing. Yes. Hang on. 20 seconds to go. You're almost there. Stay with me now. Hang on. Yes. Coming to 10 more seconds. I like it. Finish it. Push. In four, three, two, and one. Ha, ah, back to where you were. Take this recovery here. And as you're breathing, take a moment. Think about what we've done. We're sweating, we're working out, burning a lot of calories. You're doing great. Now, one final set. All right. I know you can do this one. It's easy. I wanted to have you do a five minute drill, the last set. Right now, if you need some water, get some water. Towel if you have a towel. And let that heart rate come down. Keep it moving. Hands on the sides when you're ready. All right, I'll give you about 20 more seconds. 20 more seconds. Set up in this last and final set. I'm gonna give you five minute drill, but what I'm gonna ask you to do is we're gonna find the edge, that moment where you're not able to keep the pace. So I want you to find your RPMs, the first line, that you find comfortable for you. Yeah, some people like to go fast, some people like to go slow. Let's find the RPMs now. Find your gear that you can push at least half of your body weight. So again, if you weigh 100 pounds, push 50 watts. Easy, yeah? Let's try that. Hold it here. Just hold it. I'm going to give you one more. I'm sorry, 40 more seconds. Yeah, not a minute. You don't need a minute. You just need 40 seconds. There you go. Steady. Watch the RPMs. Again, everyone likes to ride at a different pace. So some people like to ride a little slower, some faster. Find what works for you. And as you find the gear, find half of your body weight. 15 seconds to go. Are you on the edge yet? I don't think so. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're gonna take this up. Every 15 seconds, I'm gonna have you gear up. One to two gears till you find your edge. Ready? Let's gear up. Notice the change. You have went up with the, gear, with the gear, and now you're pushing more power. But can you keep the same RPMs? Revolution per minute. Good, good form. You know I'm gonna ask you, right? Let's go up another gear. So every 15 seconds, I'm gonna have you go up a little more until you find the edge. You've already taken two changes on the gear. Ready for the third one? All right, let's do it. How about another gear? So I'm gonna try to get you as high as you can on the power, maintain, you're on the edge, on the edge of that heart rate getting really high and out of breath. We've already done three changes. Let's change it again, another gear up. Let's go. Ooh, it's getting tough. Now check that body position. You're starting to push more power. We're gonna hold and sustain this. Now if you've already found your edge, then stay there. Otherwise, gear up one more time. Oh yeah. Now some of you are on the edge right now. Hold it here. Again, give me what you got. That's all we ask. Uh-huh. All right, how about one more gear change? Ready? Let's do it. <laughs> Good. Let's hold. Breathing. Watch the position of the upper body. Keep those shoulders down, guys. That's it. Maintain. Take some breaths. Hold on. You got it. Steady. Good form. Push both legs evenly. Coming up to 15 more seconds. Am I going to have you gear up? No. I'm just going to have you hold this one for three more minutes. Just hold. Good. Ready? Starts now. Three minutes. Let's go. Find the edge. 
and hold. Now, if you're getting a little tired with the hand position two, move your hands to position one. That's it. Check that position. Shoulders down again. Bend those elbows. And keep that pace. Now, if you start to get a little on breath, hard for you to keep this pace, take it down a gear. That's okay. And hold it. Find that high, steady state. Get that body to become more efficient and hold it there. Good, 30 seconds down. Two minutes, 30 seconds to go. Yes. Check out the legs again. Push both legs evenly. Right leg pushes down, left leg pushes down. For now, give me right leg. Hold the edge there. Oh yeah. Now we're sweating. Body's trying to go in overload. Yes, on the edge. Breathing, switching left leg. One minute down, two minutes to go. Hang on with me. Steady. Breathe. Take another inhale. Exhale, switch, right leg again. Pull that edge. Pushing out. Come on. Yes. Inhale, switch, last time left leg. Breathe. Hang on. Almost there. Hold the edge, guys. Hold the edge right there. Hang on. Really overloading. Steady. Stay consistent. Both legs push. Breathe. Coming up to the final two minutes. Change the hand position if you want to two. Go. Watch the shoulders out there. I see you. Keep those shoulders down. Steady. Good. Can you hold? Stay on the edge. Breathe, coming to the final two minutes of this. And then we're done. Hang on. Push it through. Steady legs. Got it, come on. Looking good. Keep the pace. Don't slow down, hold that edge. Strong through the body position. Soften the elbows here. Good. One minute, 30 seconds, yeah? Then we're there. Ah, yes. Breathing steady. Come on, come on. Almost there. <laughs> Gotta hang on. I tell you what, we're coming to the final minute. Here it comes. Starting right now. Woo! Gotta hang on. Keep the pace. Breathe. Feel that sweat coming down. We're coming to the end here. Keep it strong. Finish what we started. Coming to the last 45 seconds. Yes. Hang on. Finish it strong, guys. We're coming up to the last 30 seconds. Stay with me here. Keep that chest up. Don't let go. Don't let go. Push. Here comes final 20 seconds. On the go. Finish. Come on, come on. Coming up to the final 10 seconds. Here it comes. Here it comes. Here we go. In five, four, three, two, one. Ah. Take that gear down. Get some water, get some oxygen in your body. Breathe. You guys did great today. Great workout. I want to thank you for joining me today for the Kaiser MD workout series. My name is Buddy, and I hope you join us for some other workouts that we have available. I'll see you soon. Just keep riding. Get about 30 seconds. Just keep pedaling. Get your water. Keep cooling down. Great job, everyone. <laughs>